is me today, and today, the official Five Nights at Freddy's Plus official trailer has come, has come out. I am watching this on, I forgot what the channel is called, it's, I think it's pronounced like Illumit, Illumit Team? It's really, it's a weird name, it's it, it basically the YouTube channel that used to do those like, what was it called, World of Jump Scare videos, where you where he, whoever he was, used to just get the videos of, from like fan games and from the official FNAF games and just make a giant compilation out of them. Yeah, so I'll put the the, the original video in the link in the description and and the Steam page for it because I think this is where it or originated from. So anyway, it's under two minutes, so it's, it seems like going to be interesting. It does seem like that. So anyway, about to redo, let's watch. Oh, it's Freddy. Like, I really do like the models for this, for Five Nights at Freddy's Plus. Oh. These are from the... These are from, like, what was it What was it called again, like... These are from, like, the... No, that's, like, the news peep clipping. I've seen these before, actually. Oh, yeah, these are, like, the video, the breaking and entering video. It's, quite, it's well edited, it is decently well edited. Oh, oh, some gameplay. Oh, it looks good. It looks really... Oh, f Jesus. Oh, you can hear laughing now. Alright. Whoa. Hmm. I still think about Bonnie's eyes make it scarier. Some, some cheap Freddy and, and Bonnie's... Freddy, Freddy's and Chico's, in my opinion. So it's on Steam now. All right. Okay. So actually, I think it's over now. I believe it is over now. Um. Right. What did I think about what's this? Oh, this is subscribe. Don't think it's anything important. But but anyway. I thought the trailer was alright. I thought it was good. Like it did show enough gameplay for it to be in, to show the basic premise of it. I think it had like it had good background music. I really liked it. Like Right, see like like I know people already have gone through this before, but I never actually state my opinion on the characters. So and I I used to think that, to be fair, that Freddy out of all of these was the scariest one, which I don't think is a like a popular like opinion. But I, but just looking at it now, I think Bonnie is the scariest. Look at those eyes; those eyes are awful, in a good way. So I actually say it's it has to be Bonnie for this one. But I think the I do like the designs for the for the characters. Like I know lots of people actually say, not lots of people. I know some people say they are a bit too scary and unrealistic but like I've, I've seen videos of like old like what was it called again rock fire explosion like animatronics you know like the other Chuck E. Cheese I think you know like those competitive like it was like the biggest competitor Chuck E. Cheese we do kind of look similar to that to an extent so I don't see how it looks unrealistic in my eyes, but I think we're going off topic. We really talk about the trailer, so I've seen this before. It's like a newspaper clipping. Just it's just like a remade version of the original Five Nights at Freddy's one newspaper. But but we need to look at the gameplay. I think I'll slow it down. So as you sorry, I'll, I'll slow it down. I'm doing this live. I haven't really made a script. I don't really make scripts anyway. So uh, where where the hell is it? Um, Playback speed, yeah. So as you can see here, that kind of looks like this. Here, it kind of looks like the control panel in Five Nights at Freddy's sister location a little bit. But I don't think it's that. I think it's like a power button, maybe. You can see like a lever here, a window. You can see the watch rules. You can't really see the rules very well. But I think it's going to be just be the exact same as the one in Five Nights at Freddy's one, the original one. <laughs> uh, you can see a TV out of there, a cup. So it seemed like a, just basically seemed like a, 
wait a minute. Is this the employees only? The, the backstage room? Because it says they're employees only. So I don't... But have we changed it? Or, no, sorry, that's fifth norm actually. I think he changed it. Instead of... Instead of... Uh, the back room. Not the back room, sorry. Parts and services. Being near the... Near the... Near, you know, the stage. It's now near the office. Which is a strange move to be fair, because it'd be more simple f for the back for parts and service to, to be near the stage, near the animatronics, or it could be like a whole entirely different room. I'm not sure. It could be. It could be just like a uh, like a break room, possibly. So that's interesting. Okay, we're going on with the cameras. This this is like basically the. The dining hall. It looks. There's not much to say about it. It looks good though. Nice pointy party hats. Here, which room is this? I can't really see it well. Let's see. I think that's. Yeah, that's like the corridor where Bonnie is. Probably. I'm not sure if I changed it around. This is the office. The puppet. If you can see, is here. The puppet looks much more. This is looks much more scary. Done in Five Nights at Freddy's 2, because she's here now, which is very good. I'm not sure what role she's going to play in Five Nights at Freddy's Plus, because there's not like a music box anyway, anywhere. Uh, maybe, maybe it's maybe she's going to be replaced Golden Freddy and just like comes in as like kind of like an Easter egg and just jumps scare you in the game crash, or she's just not going to do anything at all. Because I think in his previous trailers she was shown in it. But I might be wrong. I think the puppet might play a part in in, in this game, though. So the office looks better. Today's show, it says at the top. Today's show. It doesn't have a today's show time because it's night. Uh, you, you see Foxy peeking out of the curtain. You can really see from this angle, though, though that his jaw is broken because it's very big. He has a very big mouth now. So I like the detail to it. There's a sign though, actually, they changed the sorry out of order sign, not they, I don't know why I'm saying they, it's Fiznom, so he, sorry. I keep thinking this was made by a company, like Steel Will, but, but he has changed it to have like the sign of Foxy, sorry out of order, I think that is. So like, I really do enjoy the differences that, that he made, because it is really good, it really is good. You see Chica there, this is near the, near the restrooms. Chica, it looks, it looks, she looks more dead inside than her previous one. Like, I do say though, to be fair, like, if, if you have to, like, Chica in, in the, Final Nights Freddy's one, in my opinion, was the scariest, in my opinion. And she had, like, the scariest, like, camera poses, you could say, in my opinion. Freddy probably had, well, not Freddy, yeah, I will say Freddy had was the least scary in the original game because he was kind of always in the shadows. So, like, yeah, Chica looks a bit more scary in this one, so it has improved. Uh, where is this? This is the show stage. Yeah, it is. It's actually Cam 2 instead, which is really interesting. I think Cam 1 might be, like, the entrance to Freddy Fazbear's piece, in my opinion. But you can see, like, a slight silhouette. Of Freddy here though, which is good. The light in it is very good. What else? Is there going to be anything else? You can definitely hear the laugh, can't you? That's like a child's laugh. And they are the characters. So yeah, uh, is there anything else? No, I think that's really it. Yeah, that's it. So, what's my opinion on it? Then it's a good trailer. I already said before, it's a good trailer. This is getting annoying now. 
Uh, I'm just going to turn it off, I think. Mm, yeah, sorry. I was kind of zoning out for a moment. But anyway. Uh, thanks for... Not thanks for watching, that's too soon. Uh, I really liked... I thought the trailer wasn't bad, like... The trailer wasn't bad, it was a good trailer. I think this... I'm not sure if this is going to be the only trailer for it. I'm not sure if he's going to do another one, like a trailer too. Just could be a teaser trailer, but if it is a teaser trailer, it's, it is very good. So anyway, uh, the game looks very good. I'm pleased to see that is that is doing well. The progress of the game, it looks good, very high quality. I like the changes in it. I think the animatronics are scarier than in the original Five Nights at Freddy's one. So anyway, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Goodbye.